if if you was having these problems and this was saying it couldn't be opened then go to your system preferences unclick the padlock download and install your licenses again come into the plugin manager uncheck these reset and scan license make sure you've got this open at the same time and then when it comes up do you want to trust it press yes or press ok or whatever it said I'm doing this video because I tried to look for help on this and I was there for two hours and I couldn't find anything. It was all for versions well before 11. The only version 11 video was showing you how to install it if it all works perfectly. I wouldn't have gone there if it worked perfectly because it tells you how to do it on its own website. So basically, about two hours ago, I downloaded this Waves Tune real-time demo. I followed the instructions. I said install. I said activate license. I did what Waves tell you to do. Then I went to Logic and this was happening. I recorded the screen to send it to waves in case they needed it it kept on coming up saying rescan license and over here you can say c it says compatibility comp oh my gosh i can't talk compatibility could not be opened so this is the screen i had in a uh, in the wave central the advice was restart your computer the advice was clear the cache there was videos on youtube saying do xyz none of those things worked but as you can see here this it's saying waves tune real time does not have a license i was like big man my license is right there I had it about 20 minutes ago. So there was a reason it was not registering with my computer. That I didn't understand why. This could not be open thing down here just means that when I went to the plugins in, in Logic, Waves wasn't showing up. My other ones were, but Waves wasn't. When I unchecked use, I unchecked these and pressed reset and rescan license. When it nearly got to completion, I had this message. It can't be opened because the developer can't be verified. And then it said Kekka created a file on an unknown database. I don't know who Kekka is and what she's doing on my computer, but I googling her and going to the Reddit didn't tell me nothing either. I pressed this little question mark beauty here. And basically that took me to this. Now on some of the other, the older versions of the update iOS, there's another option down here that says anybody or anywhere or everywhere or something like that. And basically it's saying on my computer, my security settings are set that Waves is an identified developer, but you can't click anybody like you used to be able to. So I had to click this um, padlock, drop my password in. So it's open now. Then I went back to the plugin manager in Logic, unchecked these so they weren't checked and press reset and scan selection. I had this open at the same time and then a little message popped up here saying did I want to open anyway? Did I want to trust the framework? I pressed open anyway and then it worked. So let me go into logic and show you what it looks like now. So now when I come down to here, it's there. Dual mana and it worked. How to make it do it live, I do I do not know yet, but like it is what it is. It works as auto tune in the meantime. That's the next problem for another day. But if, if you was having these problems and this was saying it couldn't be opened, then go to your system preferences, unclick the padlock, download and install your licenses again. Come into the plugin manager, uncheck these, reset and scan license. Make sure you've got this open at the same time. And then when it comes up, do you want to trust it? Press yes or press OK or whatever it said. And that should uh, get you to this position. Okay.